Yo YouTube, what's going on? In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to play Pokemon on your iPhone. I'm going to show you guys how to do this. This is working for Android as well, but basically a mobile device. What I'm going to do is turn on my screen recording so you guys can go ahead and see this and I can actually show you what to do um, and run you through exactly how to do this. Like I said, this is going to be completely for free. It's going to work easily, instantly, and let's go. So you won't need a computer for this, by the way, so just need your iPhone. As you guys can see here, I have this little app here called Delta. So what we're going to be doing here today is installing Delta, um, and then you can go ahead and get the games. So there's, um, this is what Delta is. You can go ahead and get um, your files and just import whatever game you want. Um, I've got them in files. They're easy to get. I can't show you that. But simply, you just hit, hit, tap on this, and it's going to begin to play Pokemon Fire Red, which is my favorite Pokemon from when I was a kid. Um, and it completely works on your phone, just like that. Like, literally so easy. Um, you can start, and it will work. And just play this at home, at school, wherever you are, at work, whatever you guys do now, I don't know. Anyway, what we're going to do now is show you how to go ahead and get the Delta emulator. Like I said, this is completely for free. It doesn't require any, um, like, computer or jailbreaking or anything like that, and it works on Android as well, both with the same method. So, on iOS, though, first we need to do is head over to Settings, and then go to general and then find background app refresh. Now you need to have this on in order for this to work. You need to make sure you have background app refresh on, otherwise this will not work for you. So make sure you turn that on, cool. Next also you wanna go down to battery and make sure you are not on low power mode. If you are on um, low power mode, it will not allow you to install the plugin. So make sure you guys are turning that off, very important. Okay. Now let's go ahead and install Delta. So what you want to do um, is go over here to Google or your browser, whatever browser you want, Google Chrome, Firefox, Safari, I'm on Safari, and we're going to visit this website here called easyplugin.com. I'm going to spell it out for you. www.ezyplugin.com. Easyplugin.com. And this is where we can go ahead and get easy plugins. Like I said, super easy. There's a list of plugins. That's how you spell it, by the way. Um, no space, easy, E-Z-Y, and then plugin.com, all one word. Go to the search bar here and just type in Delta, so D-E-L-T-A, and you're gonna see Delta Emulator, install it for iOS and Android. It does work for Android as well, guys, don't worry. Um, and click on this, and then press Start Install. Now, what you're gonna do is simply wait for this to connect to your device or your phone or your tablet. It's gonna go ahead and download the Delta Emulator to your device right now it shouldn't take too long um about a minute or so and then we can go ahead and get the roms and you guys i'm not going to show you that but you can just if you google it you'll be able to find it um and yeah what's that's going to do is basically going to go ahead and install the delta emulator now in order for it to install it is going to need two to three free additional plugin files in order to actually go ahead and install the emulator now they're going to be completely free they're going to be on the next page there's going to be a list of them there's also going to be a youtube video there so if you need any help i recommend just watching the youtube video it's going to explain it it's going to take about five minutes or so in order to get the additional plugin files, um, but that YouTube video will basically go ahead and explain everything for you, make it a lot easier to understand, um, and make sure you guys are doing that. So yeah, make sure you guys do do that, um, and yeah, that's basically it. Once you've got that, guys, you've got the additional plugin files installed, that will then install the Delta emulator. You can go ahead and open it up, um, and then you can obviously use save states, um, load cheat codes if you want, um, and then you can go ahead and start loading into your favorite Pokemon game. Um, and yeah, they do come installed with some, um, but you can go ahead and get the ROMs very easily. So if you need that, go watch another video or just Google something uh, like GBA ROM, something like that. You should, be able, you should be able to work it out. Alrighty guys, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.